All right, today I'm going to show you how to make logos for X4. I did a Creative Commons logo search through DuckDuckGo and found a shark image I like. We're going to stick with the boron theme. We went with this image here. And if you open that with Inkscape, you can right click on the image and trace bitmap. There are two options I like here, brightness cutoff and edge detection. I'm going to go with edge detection this time, but you'll need to play around with them and see uh, what you prefer. Then I'm going to go to layers and objects, and if these options aren't here, you can find them in this little menu. I'm going to go to image, and we're going to delete that image out so that we just have the trace left. Now look at the noise that we've got here. We want to get rid of that. Pick the eraser tool and erase all that extra stuff. I'm going to leave just a little bit. Now you'll notice when I select the shark that it's not selected only the shark, but this extra stuff up here. So that's a way to know that you didn't get it all. Now we're down to the shark selection. The thing about X4 is it wants a square logo. So I'm going to go to Document Properties. And I'm just going to copy the width into the height to make a square. Zoom out a little bit and enlarge the image. Now see how the image is distorted when I enlarge it? If you hold down the control key, it'll actually keep it in the correct aspect ratio. And you can go to a line and do a center align. And let's change the color to something nice. File export. See this 551? height. It's really not big enough for us, so I'm just going to bump that up to uh, 5,000. X4, the bigger you make it, the better it's going to look in-game. I'm going to export that. And I'm going to rename that to, let's say, Shark. If you open that up, you can see there's our vector, or our logo. So if you copy that, and paste it in the Documents, EgoSoft, X4. There should be a number and there should be a Logos folder. If there isn't a Logos folder, go ahead and create one and then throw this inside of it. And then reload X4. In this case, I've loaded it ahead of time for the purposes of the video. And we're going to put on a custom logo of our shark. And there it is. Nothing special, but for as quickly as we were able to do it, I think you'll be able to have some fun with this. Take care.